Hands off. Fanny here for Leo's Daily Oracle Message. Oh, okay. Yeah. Leo, your first card is perspective. That little dot way there is our earth. None of this matters. Zoom out. Common ground. This reminds me of something that happened to me when I was working at my um, arts and crafts job at Michael's. I was a replenishment. And I was stocking very, very early in the morning, like 4 or 5 o'clock or something, way before the store even started. I was in an area of the store completely by myself. And no one was near me. But I heard the words, clear as day, as someone that was behind me, it doesn't even matter. And it, I've thought a lot about what that has meant. And so it, that just reminds me of that. Um, your next cards are Earth School, Life Lessons, Soul Growth, Study, Higher Learning, Loosen Your Grip, Coping Mechanisms, Density, Addiction, Let God In, and Baby Steps, Action, Follow Your Intuition Before It Makes Sense. This is such a beautiful, heartwarming message for Leo. Because, like, it started off so dreary with this, but everything else is so bright. So maybe you have been focusing on the wrong things. Maybe you have been focusing on things that have just ended up draining you and, and led you down paths where you are using substances, where you're feeding into your addictions. And not feeling fully everything that's going on inside of you. And I understand that often it's very overwhelming, everything that you feel, especially if you're first coming into spirituality, developing your gifts, going through your soul growth and shadow work for the first time, especially if you don't have a support system. It feels like you're completely falling apart, and it's so easy to fall into coping mechanisms like escapism, distractions, addictions, because it makes it all so much easier to deal with, but it's just putting a band-aid on a massive leak. These things that you are going through are going to be massive changes, but baby steps. Your intuition will help you. Your intuition will guide you because it is our direct connection to our higher self, the part of our soul that is still attached to spirit's source. And so shifting your perspective is one of the easiest and simplest ways to reorient your foundation. And maybe you need to do this physically. You need to physically get to a higher elevation so that you could realize it's all going to be okay because those problems are only as big as you make them. I know that there are so many issues that I have gone through and things that I would rack my brain about for weeks. And when it finally came to doing it, it was over very quickly. And so all that time and energy I wasted worrying about it was just needless strain on myself and on my soul. And so, Leo, whatever it is you're going through, whatever you're putting your passion and your fire into, try and open the communication with spirit. Yep, we have star bathing, light body, crystal grid, transmission, activation. Star ancestors, hidden secrets, lost wisdom, look a little deeper. And the void. Stop. Embrace winter. Great cosmic womb. Yes. My Leos, you're going through quite a shift and awakening. Called. Soul gifts and training. It is time to step up. Okay. You're coming into your main character energy phase, Leo. And I love this for you. You're not holding yourself back for anyone anymore. You're not holding yourself back from everything that you have inside of you. All of that potential that wants to be seen, that wants to be shared, that needs to be heard. You are here for a reason. Your journey is your offering. Rooted by Aisha Badron, one of my favorite songs ever. Leo, I invite you to invite spirit in and follow your heart where it leads you, even if it does not make sense. Because this is our truest <laughs> compass. This can get all caught up. But when they're in tune, when they're aligned, your magic is sublime and you can do anything. Have a beautiful day, Leo.